There are moments you want to cherish from your unique point of view. Moments you can't recreate. When you want to experience and capture the moment at the same time. When you need to unleash your camera and let it fly. Introducing Cellfly, a smart autonomous flying camera that doubles as a 9mm thin phone case. It is with you at all times, ready to capture and share the perfect shot you could only dream of. Cellfly takes off and hovers autonomously, operated in real time through your phone to catch the perfect shot you want. Cellfly flies by itself like an invisible tripod, easily controlled by adjusting the frame with simple hand gestures. Cellfly is a smart flying camera. Anything your smartphone is able to detect or process could be sent to control Cellfly and enable incredible features like face and smile recognition, sweet panoramic, or even follow your movements. And of course you can share them instantly on all your social platforms. Cellfly folds to a 9mm slim design thanks to the unique motor folding mechanism so it can easily fit comfortably in your pocket. Cellfly is your point of view from a new exciting angle. Be the first to get Cellfly by supporting us on Kickstarter. I wondered, why is the record always spinning? Well, the status test put. I decided to flip that around. There are beautiful objects that have played records, you know, references that already exist. How do we stand out? Because by standing out, we're honoring what's already been done. We're not trying to replace it, we're trying to be a new experience. Love is the world's first intelligent turntable. It's easy to use and it's controlled by your smartphone. I strongly believe that you can have a fine sound, you can have an audiophile sound, and make it easy to use. The needle is what's convinced people for over 150 years. This warmth, this soulful sound that is unique and that cannot be replaced by something digital. So we're using the most widespread industry standard size cartridge. We've kept those elements and we've just augmented them in a way that allows you to do things you could never do before. You can play, pause, skip to the next track or select the next track. You don't need the app to use love, but its app makes it revolutionary. Once you've captured the sound, what do you do with it? Well, you process it in a way that allows it to communicate to a Bluetooth speaker or to a phone in a very high quality way. Streaming of the sound does not change or harm the analog sound because we're using the very best codec available with the very best transmission there is. So the sound stays the same. That's really what a great wireless sound connectivity means. I would love the Love Tone Table to be a synonym for quality before anything else. There will be a wow moment of uh, look at this object, it's starting to turn, but as soon as the sound will come on, I think it's still the vinyl, it's still the record, it's still the music, that is what you're looking for.
is more than 80% in Metro Manila. As air pollution levels in the British We should see a huge region. environmental impact. According to the World Health Organization, even trigger lung And so Delhi there once again topping the police charge. Situation in Beijing the was air being air, dirty records. Air Inc. is about capturing air pollution before it enters the environment from your cars, from your trucks, from your diesel generators that are spitting out this particulate matter and then converting that into inks of various sorts. We did the initial research and prototyping for this idea at the MIT Media Lab. For the last three years, we have been getting our hands dirty on the roads of Bangalore to solve this problem. After we are done capturing air pollution, we take it through a purification process and then we treat it with solvents to create printing inks. developing new ways to be able to paint and create without the negative effect on nature is an awesome idea. I'm so into it. There's so much pollution that just half an hour can paint an entire pair of shoes. I'm excited to work with something, uh, an ink that will merge both together, beauty and environmental awareness, a way to advance humanity and to save the space around us. At Graviki, we started as a small group of hackers supplying science, technology and creativity to solve hard problems. We thought, how can we take something that's totally undesirable, ugly and as bad as air pollution and turn it into something beautiful, something that everyone uses, as common as inks. So every stroke on paper that you make is essentially a quantification of that particulate matter you would have otherwise breathed in when you're walking outdoors. By backing us, you help us scale up pollution capture technology and bring air ink to as many people as possible. What's the best place for this carbon soot to go? Is it your lungs or is it something like inks that we make?